Hi, this is Sunil from Learning Lad with a video tutorial on C programming. So, in this tutorial, we're gonna see one more math function called pow used to calculate the power of a number raised to some value. So, we're gonna see the syntax of this function and also you know how we can use this function in our program. So, this pow function is used to calculate the power of a number raised to some value. And as a parameter, we need to pass two numbers. The first is the number which is considered as the base and uh, next and the second parameter is a number which is considered as the exponent and this power function is going to return the power of this number base raised to the value exp okay which is nothing but you know if our base is let's say 2 and our exp is 16 and this function is going to return 2 to the power of 16 and also if it is uh, let's say 4 and it is 2 then it's gonna return a value of 16 and uh, you know if this uh, base is any number let's say 100 and this exp is 0 then the value returned will be 1 and if this base is 0 and this exp is uh, a value which is less than or equal to 0 then uh, the function is gonna produce a domain error and also you know if this base is negative and this exp is uh, not an integer value then, then also you know there is the possibility of the domain error and also you know there is a possibility of some range error because you now because if the result you know exceeds the range of this double okay now I'm gonna teach you how to use this function in our program so here just for the demonstration purpose what we're gonna do is we're gonna create two variables both are of type double and uh, we're gonna call it as base and uh, next one is exp so next we're gonna initialize these two variables so it's gonna be base equal to let's say a value of um, 4.0 and then exp equal to a value of um, let's say 6.0 okay next we're gonna use a printf statement and we're gonna say percentage f to the power of percentage f is percentage f that's pretty cool and here we're gonna refer our base first base to the power of this exp is result so it's gonna be exp and then we're gonna call the power function so it's gonna be pow and as a parameter we need to pass the base and then the exp so this is it now uh, when I run this program this function is gonna calculate the 4 to the power of 6 so I'm gonna compile and run this okay you can see here 4 to the power of 6 is 4096 similarly you can change this base and exp numbers so, and let's say we want 2 to the power of 8 so I'm gonna save this compile and run so 2 to the power of 8 is 256 okay now let's say what happens if this is a large number 100 and this exp is 0 the value should be 1 yes that's it so this is it guys this is about the pow or power function which is used to calculate the power of a number raised to some value and um, and thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel like my facebook page at facebook.com slash learning and uh, if you guys have any doubts then don't hesitate to put a comment in the video and i see you in the next tutorial